Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific and crackling atmosphere the match i think will be quite a spectacle we have terrific scenes in front of us at the estadio do Dragao, one of the biggest venues in portugal performance and now here comes the response So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? Yeah, Christian Eriksen. He's super accurate with both feet, Peter, and able to deliver a cross or a through ball with just the perfect bend or, indeed, weight. All this allied to great awareness and vision, which make him a massive creative talent. What I really like about Eriksen, though, is that he's got the energy and the determination to keep going for 90 minutes every game. He's a trier. Yeah, I'm inclined to agree. got things on the way forward it goes that's a chance goal Denmark well the whole idea is to start as you mean to go on and that sets their tone beautifully that has brought the house down what a wonderful hit yeah, I just thought he made great use of his upper body there. It would have taken something really special to keep that in. Denmark go ahead, one goal to the good. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. They've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Tries to get it forward quickly. Plays it out to the flank. Oh, it's a searing run. He is a man on a mission. Aimed in massive leap. He will be livid with himself. Hoists it forward. And it's played forward. Denmark scored early, of course, and it's 1-0. 
And here's Ericsson. He goes long. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. Played out to the right. Gorgeous control there. Can he deliver? Ericsson. He's gone for it! Oh, good effort. He got plenty on that. Christian Eriksen brilliantly took control of that, which was exactly what the situation required. Tries to get it forward quickly. Over to the left. And that's put paid to a promising move. Hit long and direct. Played into space out wide. Hoists it forward. And he's... Has a hit! That was mighty close. Forward it goes. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Cuts it out. <laughs> and now the breakaway. Good idea, just poorly executed. Ericsson tried to play it through. Yeah, the idea was right, the delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. It is a corner. And that's been lever clear. And we hit half time. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but that has still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. That gets things going for the second half. Denmark carrying a one-goal lead. Gets into a dangerous position. Ericsson. He's had a look. He's making good use of his strength there. Just refuses to be outmuscled. Goes for goal! Gets good distance on it. That is terrific skill.
And it's Hoiberg. And it's played forward. They might, they just couldn't get into an attacking area. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Hoists it forward. He's made sure that that won't get through. Talk about singling someone out. Well, there's certainly a, a coordinated attempt to shut him down, which is, I suppose, a natural response. Forward it goes. Tries to get it forward quickly. Forward it goes. Tries a shot! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Serbia are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Who's he going to play in? Gets it back. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Whipped in. And it's hoisted clear. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Almost there, and the players can feel it. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue this situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. And that is it, the referee has seen it off. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim?